got the dang boat race going on back here. Freaking Catalina wine mixer. Whoa. We got one, we got a net, boys. Oh Teacock. It's a giant, bro. Here we are, here we are. Another peat and heat adventure. <laughs> Me and Teacock about to dump this skeeter in here at the old home pond see if we can go get on them. I fished out here yesterday it was kind of tough I think I caught like five or six fish no pattern to speak of I was just fun fishing and threw everything and ended up getting lucky a couple times but it was tough so hopefully they got hungry overnight me and Teacock can go find them we got some some different stuff on deck we actually brought the freaking finesse gear believe it or not we got spinning rods Let's see what else I got a wacky worm that's crazy swim jig jackhammer of course I got the mini draw and a catwalk, and that's what we're starting off with today. But I'm about to dump the boat in for Teacock, and then we're gonna go see if we can freaking catch a fish today. So come along, roll with us. Pete and Heat, dude. Oh, got it. It's grass. Find the grass, find the bass. That's what we're trying to do. We've been told. That's what I heard anyway. So somebody said, beard's all blown out from the run we just made. Time to catch the fish. All right. Awesome. On the freaking catwalk, dude. That was sick. Look how clear this water is. That's it, bro. That did not take long. Too much fun with the freaking beautiful lime green hydrilla just hanging off his face. If you don't mind, if you don't flop back in the water, man. Go up there and show that fish to that camera, even though he's a little dude. <laughs> Take the boat, bro. I don't know what I'm doing. I don't want to hit anything. Oh, I missed it. Oh, I took it. Not at? No. I don't know what I'm trying to say. That's so awesome. That's a little bit better one, maybe. Decent. Heck yeah, dude. Not as little as I thought he was. Right. That is fun right there. It's, it's fun watching you catch them. This water is so clear. Dang, Teacock lighting them up, dude. One, two, three. They're on that pink one, dude. A Spanish rose. Heck yeah, dude. I gotta give me one. Come on, let's get on the board. Oh, this is awesome. So we tried to come fish this before, but it never made the it never made a video. Yeah, we, we didn't, didn't do catch too, them in here. Yeah, we didn't do too good. So hopefully I can bust one here soon. But shoot, I'm cool to watch the Teacock just keep cracking them. The little cat. This is the little cat. We got the big cat and the little cat now. The, the kitty cat. Yeah. You ain't never seen one of these before, Teacock. At least not in my hand. No. A weighted whack ring. Whatever they call it. I ain't gonna start throwing it yet. Not with the way they're hitting that, that rose. God dang. Teacock doesn't lay in the wood to him out here. That one is crazy. Four is more. Put your shit cut. Put your shit cut. Calm yourself, cut. Well, Travis is smashing. No surprise there. Give me one. That's motivating. Watch somebody blast four on top water in five minutes. I'm gonna try it, dude. 
See, see what it's about. It's a snag. I was about to say, no way. Yeah, this is it. This is bullshit, dude. This is supposed to be fun, easy peepaw fishing. Get me snagged in the grass. I was catching them on that boosa worm yesterday. That's the first fish on that thing. I like that worm, man. I like it. It looks good. So the plastic is so nice on it. Like, it's just, it's all action, dude. <laughs> wow. Hard to argue with that. Stop moving it. Not the big one I've, I got a feeling about. Dude. Wow. I thought you felt sick. Peacock is busting their butt, this catwalk, and I'm just along for the ride. We'll follow the right strip. Get eight pins one at a time. That fish absolutely came at six, 600 miles an hour to eat this catwalk, dude. That was insane. He had the afterburners on when he hit this thing, dude. All right, I got one, Teacock. He hit it like a berserker. These catwalks are calling them from a long way off, dude. Mm -hmm. they're, they're traveling to eat these things. Got one. Later, buddy. It up. Check him out. Healthy. He got black lipstick. Mm -hmm. Freaking inhaled it, dude. He inhaled it. Slurped it up. Check that fish out. Black lips, black spots. Later. Oh, yes. There we go. Oh. Yeah, it is. I mean, that's one of the day right there. Heck yeah. I have one coming after me, too. Heck yeah, dude. Nice work, bro. Best one on the day. Chunky fish. On top water. Beautiful. Uh, last week, whatever that was. When you ain't around them, they don't eat. Mmm. Mmm, mmm, mmm. Another bed right there. Blue Here, thick, boy. There's a bass right there. Another one. Little guy. Yeah, man, that is just too cool. Never gets old, dude. No matter how big or small they are, just watching them swim up to the boat with a freaking bait hanging out of their face. Mm, that's just special. I'd love to bust one on this glide right off the edge out here, man. Whoa. Spawning gar, yep. <laughs> Big. Fish number nine, though. Dang! Oh yeah, that's that. They almost got like a, a turquoise blue here yeah. when they get that color, man. Awesome. Yep. You put 
two? Yep, I got two, both on the catwalk. We got the dang boat race going on back here. Freaking Catalina wine mixer. All right, we got the Catalina wine mixer going on back here behind us. Me and Teacock on spot number two. We put nine fish in the boat so far. Well, Teacock did. He caught seven, I caught two, all on the catwalk. And we're gonna throw a drop shot now, see if we can get on them with a little bit of finesse. Catalina wine mixer, spot number two. Let's keep it rolling. What am I fishing here, Teacock? This is just a big flat out in front of us. So they're right here on the break block. Kind of that way, but they're still some out about 40 foot in front of them. Kind of towards that big Texas flag over there. What size line you throwing? A uh, 10 pound braid to eight pound leader. Freaking sailboats ain't playing, dude. I can't say I've ever seen them with that front sail. Nice. We on them out here, boys. We on them. Coming up here, a little yeet. Give up. Pretty fish. That's what them good ones are good at. Those little ones are good at. Messing that line up. You <laughs> get down there spinning. Popped one on the, the drop shotty John Gotti. Ba boom, ba boom, boom. He thumped it too. Oh man, dude, he freaking, <laughs> he murdered me. Finesse fishing right here in a nutshell. Holy smokes. He run the bait up the line and then tied it in 67 knots. Yeah, that one just thumped it one time. Thump. Don't be interfering with the Catalina wine mixer. All right, three hours later. Double. You got a big one? No, I think I got the ground. <laughs> oh, God. Yeah. Hey, hey, hey. Dang. When the drag starts singing like that, I'm like, oh, that's a fish. He's running. You hear it? No. Nobody heard it, bro. There's no button. You got to flip the little thing. I don't know if you knew that. A little yeeter. Another one of those. He's another one of those. Let me mess your drop shot label. Oh, your line. You'll be catching those, and then all of a sudden, <laughs> screaming eagle, screeching Retha. <laughs> oh, Retha got a hold of it, Teacock. Got him. It worked. Yeah, it is. That bubble gum hanging out of his face. That one showed himself. Dad. Chunky. He eating. The thickness. He got the right build. He just needs about eight more 10 pounds. or 15 more inches, eight more pounds. Yeah. Got to practice on that real thing. Not that. Not the yanking crack them. Yeah, I know. That's a it's a it's a hurdle for me too, dude. I'm always like swing on when you really just need to lift up into it. All right, dude. Two in a row. Yeah, I'm fishing with that pink. That pink is the deal. Just landed on them. We need a pink. 
freaking glitch, that's for sure. Well, we're dropping like a small mountain. I wish they had small mountains. Like, they would grow big. Yeah. Choked it. something nope what, what happened there dude did you see that did you see that dude i set the hook and it was like a whole bunch of extra freaking line came out or something that was so weird dude quadster quad city oh uh, what what just happened bro did you see that i did that was very very weird yes yeah, my brain just can't wrap it i can't wrap my brain around what just happened there we go Guadalupe on the record breaker. I'm gonna keep throwing it. Well, I was definitely coming straight through that chunk rock because I was. Remember, I said literally counting rocks. Yeah. And then boom, I got bit. I'm throwing eight pound test, so it's got to be at least eight. At least at least nine, dude. Didn't have my spider wire. Didn't even feel that one bite it. That's called the two. I just got well, it. Just got funny on me. I was like, eh. And they were right there in that chunk rock, dude. Right out in front of the boat. They're right there on the break. Yep. Another decent quad, dude. Yeah, it is. Calm down, son. Threw my glitch off into the boat somewhere. All right. Starting to get on a little bit more consistency. This Guadalupster just ate the glitch. Record breaker throwing a little drop shot. Guadalupster. All right, later buddy. Here's the depth that I'm fishing. Shimano Sedona 2500, 10 pound braid to eight pound fluoro leader. USA custom series, six cents rod, seven foot medium. Getting it done. Yeah, dude, anything like little bitty. I have a Ned Rig box, but anything else that's like little bitty, small finesse, whether it be little swim baits or a drop shot, so I'll pack it all into right here, dude. That color right there, that's fire. I do like that color. Yeah, dude, without this rod, I might not have caught that last fish, dude. That's how you catch one, dude. Let it, you gotta let it soak. A little better fish? No, he's not what I've been catching. Giant. Giants only. Right here. Cool. Let's throw them on the grams, he caught. Yeah, I'm talking about holding dogs. You don't want to come to the boat. Teacock, I don't know what we're fishing with, but we're catching them. <laughs> what is this? How do you work this thing? Heck yeah, dude. On the long soak. You just pop it on the bottom. And they just start swimming off with it. Or just let it sit there. That's what I did on that one. It was just sitting there. My first one ate, the first one that I caught ate it when I was pretty much dead sticking it. He hit it before, like, I didn't even get the chance to that move. Last one I caught, the he hit it on the, like, either it fell in front of him and he ate it immediately, or I didn't even get a chance to drag it. He's shaking. Oh, come on, little yeeter. I put us right on him, Teacock. That's what I did, bro. I put us right over here on them. I'm going to expect any amount over $50 commission from your trip tomorrow. Putting you on these. <laughs> Better not be no 50 bucks, bro. Hey, Cook. 
If you send me 50, I ain't even responding. I'll make it 51. <laughs> That's how you do it, right? Little dude. He's munching, though. Yee. Going up here to get skunked on this point. See y'all later. Such a subtle bite, dude. I mean, barely made a sound. He just a little cut. That's why. The guad. Sharp ass teeth. He's munching. He got he built like a like a OH Ivy fish, man. Gutted. Later, buddy. T cock hooked up. I can hear it. Big game. Oh my oh, god. It is a big one. It's a whale. Woo. We got one, we got a net, boys. Teacock. It's a giant, bro. It's a certified Lake Travis dragon right here, boys. She slipped up, Teacock. These angles. Shit, mine's in the water. I got it. I got it. We're good. Holy shit. Be easy with her, bro. Oh, I'm being easy. <laughs> Twelve minute fight, Teacock. <laughs> she ain't ready. Come on, old girl. Bro, <laughs> <laughs> on the giblet right in the look at the way that fish is hooks, bro. Oh shit! <laughs> I had to put the net together, bro. That's a dragon. Look at that freaking drop shot hook right in the roof, barely hanging on by the skin of the roof. Right here, bro. Look at that. Dudes. I mean, that's the dragon on a drop shot, boys. <laughs> Teacock out here wearing them out today, bro. You on them. Dude, look. Look, look at the skin. Dude. Dog. Look at that, guys. It's, it's, I mean, it's dangling. She wasn't going nowhere, though. Teacock made her, showed her who's the boss. Dang. That was awesome, dude. Five fourteen, almost six pounds, just shy of six. That's a dragon, dude. Spawned out on a drop shot. Yeah, that doesn't, dude. It doesn't get much more fun than that. That was just that was sick, dude. That was sick. Only a matter of time before we got on top of the right one, Hunty Cock.
Heck yeah, dude. I'm just out here watching the beat down, really, man. I'm along for a ride. He let me catch a couple, but my buddy Teacock is straight railing them today, and it's fun to watch, man. It makes me happy. We're having a blast out here, man. I hope you guys are enjoying the video. Smash that thumbs up button for that Lake Travis Dragon. The Teacock just wrangled in with the little freaking swizzle stick, dude. That was awesome. <laughs> Heck yeah, man. <laughs> she went around the boat about 13 times. <laughs> she got me hung up in that grass down there. Oh, I okay. I had to pick up. Yeah. I was like, oh shit, she, I'm gonna break her off. Nope. Nope. You took her to school. That was Dude, awesome. She jumped. I thought it was like a seven or eight pounder out there. I did too. Tough to tell at a distance. I thought she was a six looking at her in the boat too, but just shy. Hey, that's still a dragon, bro. That was awesome. And you fired up that way and caught her. Yeah, up there in that shallow edge of the grass. Bro, look your ass out when I'm on the boat, bro. <laughs> I don't know what just happened. It's always something. It's always an adventure with Pete and Heat. Boat won't start. We're not exactly sure what's going on, but we got no power. We're <laughs> quite a ways from home, so. Yeah. I'm gonna try to jump off the lithium, I guess go from there I wouldn't even put that in your video you can get all kinds of you're not supposed to do that oh yeah <laughs> we're gonna work on the boat for a minute good point I don't, I don't want to hear it from the peanut gallery on the internet all the internet mechanics uh we're gonna do whatever we have to do to get this boat fired up and uh yeah keep you guys updated but we are d-i-w dead in the water well teacock got the boat started we're good to go we were dead in the water there for about 20 minutes but it's all good man you, you can't panic because this stuff is gonna happen when you got a bass boat this is just part of the game but definitely not the most ideal situation Teacock knew what it was trim no good no trim that lithium's dead so I'm about to hook it up I gotta figure out which one my trim is <laughs> yeah we had to switch batteries I got trim. oh okay well trims trims back this one's on a different connector, I bet you. Then this is to the actual motor. Right. We're good. We're good. It's all good. Hey, five pound, fourteen ounce dragon on the swizzle stick. That's the that's the takeaway from today. It's been a good day. Still a good day. It's all gravy. You're gonna have to come at us a little bit harder than that. Put a chink in our armor, ain't that right, Teacock? Right. Teacock's the man. All right then. Well, we made it back safely. Me and Teacock gonna cut our day a little bit short out here, but we have fun, dude. Yeah. We have fun. Started out throwing the top water, smashed a few on the catwalk. Teacock freaking lay in the wood to him. And then we moved out off of a little offshore point. Started whacking him on the drop shot. Teacock, big fish on the day, five pounds, 14 ounces. Probably a little more than that, actually, because that scale weighs a little bit under, but not a bad day at all. And uh, yeah, as usual, Teacock freaking taking me to school out here, but I had a blast. Thank you for bringing me fishing, brother. Yeah, dude. I'm glad we were able to get back home safely. We're gonna throw this thing back on the trailer and that's gonna wrap up another video out here with Pete and Heat.